to start, my name is Bernard Richardson. I am the Corporate Partnerships Manager here with the Fiesta Bowl um, and Fiesta Bowl Charities. Um, and with me, I have Kevin Rolf from Salt River Project, SRP. Um, and we're excited to have you guys join us today. Uh, we have a quick announcement for you from our Fiesta Bowl Charities Wishes for Teachers program. Uh, and with that, I will kick it over to Kevin. All right, thanks, Bernard. Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. So, we are thrilled to inform you that you have been selected as a Desert Financial Fiesta Bowl Charities Wishes for Teachers program recipient. Teachers, your wishes are going to be granted. Congratulations. <laughs> yes! <Thank you. laughs> yes! How much? Yes. Right. Oh, that's great. Oh, thank you. Um, so, Ken, I see you're a special ed teacher and yes. you're you're going to use your funding for a compression room. Can you tell us a little more about that? Yeah, so um, we we have uh, kids that are on the uh, on the spectrum, as well as kids that are uh, you know emotionally disabled. And in, with that being said, a lot of the kids really have difficulties, whether it's with anxiety or adjusting to new environments or just the stress associated with uh, COVID-19. Um, and sometimes when we're presenting material, they'll there'll be certain challenges and they'll start to really kind of, um, you know, they'll start to ping a little bit. And so it's really important to have kind of like a safe area, a room that the kids can go, that they can kind of decompress to help them kind of, we, we actively encourage them to self advocate for themselves. And they'll say, hey, Mr. G, you know what? I'm really struggling right now. And it'll give a teaching opportunity to try to help them de-stress with different strategies, but we'll always have that room available to them. It's, it's critical for uh, a lot of the kids, at, at least with the ones in my class. Um, and so I cannot tell you how thankful uh, I am for you guys to uh, providing this grant. It's going to go a tremendous way in making right. an impact on the, on the lives of these kids, no doubt. That's great. That is great to hear. Um, Jamie, so I used to teach right across the street from where you're at at Tarwater. I used to work at Basha Elementary. Oh, no kidding. From, yeah. Um, so I see you're going to get Chromebooks for your class and you're the technology teacher at Tarwater? Yep, I'm a technology teacher and I'm also the um, the testing coordinator on my campus. And so with test, you know, we test a lot <laughs> on the computers and with going virtual, we ended up losing a few computers in the process and so we're short some on on campus and I just was like how can I get some more on our campus because we need computers so I am like I can't I didn't even tell my principal I did this because I was like I don't I don't want to get our hopes up but just even to get a few would mean like um a, a lot to us. so thank, thank you thank you oh that's great freaking out I'm like how are we gonna test all these kids I'm like I don't know <laughs> we'll find well, some devices so okay. I'm excited yeah well good thank well hopefully you. Hopefully this helps out quite a bit. And Elizabeth, you're also in Chandler at Serene Elementary and you are looking for some books for your classroom. So what sort of books? You're a second grade teacher, correct? Yes, so I believe in the greatest power of reading ever. And so with Serene being a Title I school, we have a lot of diversity on campus and a lot of our picture books and a lot of our texts are they focus on one type of population. So I really want diverse text. I want them to be able to access social emotional learning through their text. I want them to see themselves in literature. So hopefully I get my hands on some really quality picture books and lit studies for my kiddos and this impacts how they see themselves and how they see other people. And with history being made, you know, just over the weekend, they can dream a little bigger now with this. So thank you. Oh, that's great. That's great. Um, so at SRP, one of the things that we feel how we can best help education is to help teachers. So we're very proud to partner with Desert Financial and with uh, Fiesta Bowl Charities in order to uh, make your wishes come true today. So congratulations once again. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank with you. that, I'll throw it back to Bernard. Yeah, okay. absolutely. Thank, thank you guys so much. And, uh, you know, first I want to thank Kevin for being here with us today and SRP for their support in this program. You know, uh, without them, we couldn't, you know, give back to you teachers the way we do. Um, and so, you know, it's crucial that we have uh, phenomenal partners like SRP on this. So I want to thank, you know, Kevin specifically and then SRP as a whole. Um, but the real thanks really goes to Ken, Jamie, Elizabeth, 
to you guys, you know, everything that you guys are doing every day with our students, it's, uh, it's phenomenal and it's, it's more than needed. Um, and, and so thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, I know it's been said many, many times, but this year <laughs> tested all of us. Um, yeah. I, I know how hard it is for you guys and uh, hopefully it's, uh, this wish granted a long way for you guys to explain and, uh, and we, we look forward to following up with you guys and, and hearing how it's going in your classrooms. Awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. thank you guys so much. Have a great rest of the day. Um, if you have any questions, uh, reach out to charities at fiestable.org. Um, but somebody okay. from our charities department will be in touch with you uh, soon to um, granting you that wish officially. Thank you. Okay. Right. Thank, thank you. you. Thanks, both of you. Thank you. Congratulations to you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Bye.